Welcome to your daily guidance. I feel like pulling some tarot cards for you today. All right, Spirit, what do you have to say to those who are watching? Whoa. I said pull a Kuan Yin card first. And then we'll explain with the tarot what's going on. <laughs> you hear this little... All right. The quickening. The fast track with the Divine Mother moves us rapidly through life's challenges. The road can get a bit bumpy when traveling at her accelerated pace, uh, nor, nor will you often feel that you are in control of the navigation. This is part of the experience when you're able, when you are to be moved rapidly with divine help. Best just to hold on to her and trust you'll get to where you need to be. All right. So you're on an accelerated path. Something is being sped up here. Let's see. Okay, so maybe you felt unworthy for a while and now you're now you feel like realized your worth that you are a bright shining star and you're wanting to go on this new journey. You're wanting to start a new adventure and come out of the darkness of your life and come into the light and embrace who you really are. Um perhaps you're going to be apologizing to somebody or just having kind of a, maybe you're going to either receive a message, give a message, but whatever it is, it's going to be a little token from the heart. That's That one's not too big of a deal. Like that's just like a text message, a phone call. It's just, just something I, I just heard making an effort, like just, just making an effort. Um, so whoever this is talking about has spun, they've spun the negativity out of their lives. In every area is what I'm getting. Like they've done a cleanup job. And so now they can change. They can put their focus on you and the excitement they have for you. And they're going to throw that, throw the dice, like taking a gamble on you. So whatever they were putting all their focus on, whether it be work or another person or an addiction or something like that, it's about to be uh, focused on you now. All that attention that they were giving that person is now going to go to you. Whoa. And quickly, things may be falling. <laughs> falling into place. Okay. Again, with a small message. Now this is a text, phone call, something something like that as well. So, uh, But there are also two pages. So it could have something to do with a child or custody, or maybe there was an issue before about you guys being able to have kids or not. Something like that might be being remedied and they are not, not worried about the issue anymore for some reason. They've been enlightened as to something that's going to, that will wor work out in their favor or they've changed the way that they've looked at the situation. And then maybe they want to apologize for whatever they said to you that may have been harsh. For some of you, not everybody. Um, it could be an apology in the form of a message or text message or even a meme. I just got that some of you are going to get a, like a, an apology through like a meme or something. Um, and it's going to be wish fulfillment. You're going to be so happy to see it, whatever this is, that you're going to, whatever you're going to get or give. You're gonna, It's going to create a lot of happiness between you. Um, so... They want me to pull an empowering question. Okay. What is it that fascinates me so much that the thought of feeling, uh, thought or feeling of it won't leave me alone? How do I push this feeling into action right now? So this is why the quickening is happening is because they cannot stop thinking about you, watching you, um, you know, they cannot put to this to rest, whatever this is. You know, they they can't live without it and they know it. And so they're going to be, you know, taking action more quickly. Maybe they're, maybe people pleasing was the problem. Maybe they had to work really hard to try to figure out a way to get um, out of somebody's grasp I just got. Like out of somebody's control so that they can give back to you. Uh, they had to really strategize though. Maybe it was difficult, really difficult. They may be sneaking up on you with some communication. 
you know, they, they may um, surprise you. They may be surprised. They're, they're figuring out a way to give back to you by surprising you with some communication uh, because they know that you are their ultimate true love. And here's some verification, too, that they're spying on you and had put you up on a pedestal so they felt unworthy. But now they, um, they're they breaking free and doing what, what they want to do, breaking free of, the, of this people-pleasing and conformity. And they are uh, sneaking up on you with some good communication that they had been planning for some time. So... Um, that's awesome. So what has really, um, well, that's pretty much what's kicked them in the butt, made them really go is they just, they can't, they, they just can't leave it alone. No matter who they spend time with or what they're doing or whatever, it's like you were constantly on their mind and will not leave them alone. So the universe is like, what do you need to put into action right now to make this happen and switch your attention from that other thing or other things and onto this person and wish fulfillment now. Okay. Um, have yourselves a beautiful day and I'll talk to you tomorrow.